After a year waiting, we're finally back at the Wood Soft Trail. Let's go. What's up, everybody? Gary here from G from BC, and it's that time of the year again. We're about to hit up Whipsaw. Kind of a crappy day right now. Uh, it's <laughs> raining really badly, and the only positive that I see about it is maybe uh, there'll be less uh, people going off-roading today. That's what I'm hoping, but we'll see. Some people are hardcore, and they still kind of go. I mean. We're heading right now because uh, we pre-planned this like months ago. Right now I'm convoying with my buddy Mike who I haven't seen in a long time in his TJ uh, Sport. Anyways, we're only like about another five minutes away. We just went to Princeton to gas up and yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. It's still raining outside, but we did get to the corral where my friends are camped out right now. Travis and Steve's rigs are here. And yeah, uh, we're just about to head over to the trailhead to get to the obstacles, the actual whipsaw portion of the whipsaw trail. I haven't been here since last year, and this is gonna be definitely be an uh, interesting one since it is raining. It's not downpouring as hard anymore, so it's gonna be pretty good. Gary, back it up, come like two feet to the left and try and get on that rock that's in the middle. Ooh, sliding. Yeah. Okay, good there, go left a little bit. Yeah. A uh, li little driver. Ooh, sliding. Yes. Nice. Oh, Travis. 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 He's coming down this way. Do it. No way uh, Don't do it. Should he do it? Uh, I think so. Which way? Which is the line, though? Because the thing is, you're fighting gravity as well too, and it's wet. It's, it's like rock. Slide, yeah. yeah. I mean, if you just held brakes all the way down, it would just. Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna slide down. Yeah. All right, so I gave it a try going up that rock that we did last year. It was just too slippery. A sliding, as you guys saw. I was gonna go down and descent down that rock, but he called, give it, gave it a good call, and uh, we're not gonna do it. <laughs> I'm not gonna risk it. I still gotta drive this sheep home tonight, so yeah, playing it safe. There's like three different ways to get here.
We arrived at the hill climb obstacle where Travis gives it a shot. Man, that was pretty cool seeing Steve and Travis go up there. Fortunately, I'm not gonna try it. I still gotta drive the Jeep home and, uh, you know, try to be smart here and <laughs> not destroy the, the rig as I try to get out of here later. We're gonna continue on right now. A few of these other guys that's here right now, they're actually gonna try it as well. One guy actually in a 4Runner kind of three wheeled, kind of three wheeled on the right side, uh, which is pretty cool. Anyways, you heard it, we're gonna go now. So much more water on those uh, mud puddles that we went here last summer. So a lot of it was dried up, but yeah, this, this time around, definitely tons more uh, water in the mud puddles. Doing great so far. The rain's kind of subsided a little bit. It's not coming down as hard anymore. Just heading towards the next obstacle. I believe from my recollection, it's uh, Memorial. Oh no, tilt the world is the next one, I think. I believe that's the one, yeah. So we're on our way to tilt a whirl so let's go. We are at tilt a whirl now. Uh, you guys can see it right there. Nice. Right there. I don't think it'll be a good idea to test it right now. It's rocks are a little too uh, wet for, for my liking. Maybe next time tilt a whirl. Maybe next time. Back up, back up, and then get a momentum and uh, try to go up. There you go. Had trouble getting up that one rock obstacle there. One, one, it's raining. Two, 
Uh, line wasn't the perfect one for my rig. It's a bit shorter wheelbase, so it was hitting the cross member the whole time. I tried the line, even with the lo rear lockers on, it was still not getting the grip. So just picked a different line, which made it easy. Quick bump over it, and yeah, we got over. Just taking a quick break right now, and then uh, we're gonna head on towards Wells Lake. I think the next one after this one is, I believe, Memorial Rock is the next one. So let's go. Yeah, nice and slow. <laughs> there you go. Back up about like a foot. So close. There you go. Oh, just had it too. Once you feel the bump, just keep going. Don't let off the throttle. Ah. We continued down the trail until we hit the last rock obstacle before Memorial Rock. Oh. Send it. Send it. Oh my god. <laughs> In the way. A little bit more send it. Push it to the limit. You're almost there, bud. Oh, why did you stop? <laughs> yeah, that was awesome, dude. That was a solid attempt. Yep. Right, Lockers on, I'm baby. I'm nah, 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 nah. We have an excuse. It's raining. Yo! Steve is gonna give it a shot again. I think so. I know Travis made it look easy. I'm definitely not gonna try it. Oh, wait, hold on. Steve's gonna give it a shot again. Hold up. Yeah! <laughs> Damn. All right, I got course to do this now. I'm gonna give it a shot. Lockers on, baby. Yeah. <laughs> 
I guess sometimes peer pressure does work. I'll be honest. Uh, got halfway losing traction and I was just like, oh, I guess I guess you gotta floor it. Uh, luckily, Travis told me to go and pop it to first gear. Um, still learning, as, as you guys know. And then uh, popped it to first gear. And then, uh, yeah, just uh, got up the Memorial Rock. Not too bad, not too bad. Anyways, we're gonna continue on. I think the next one that we're gonna go to is Whoop De Whoop. And I think after that, it's Wells Lake. Anyways, continuing on. Didn't get to film it, but Steve tried this water puddle here. And then went about door height. Where's it? Let's see. Steve, let's see it. We're good. It's fine. It's fine. We just got a little wet inside. <laughs> Did it sip through underneath or oh, yeah. above? Right through it. Oh, yeah. Right in. The water was like this high. Hey, Steve, you got a stowaway. What is that? What is that? Is that insulation? It's insulation. Yeah. Oh, oh I thought it was a rat. I thought it was I thought he's your friend, I Mike. Did. <laughs> no, not my friend. So it was a rat, rat's nest then, right? Yeah, yeah. It's your friend, Mike, I tell you. <laughs> I know. It's your friend. He's I like, should not disturb him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you, you get into my house, I'll get yeah, into your house. Internet router. Oh. oh. Wheels off the ground. That's what she said.
Right, just got to the flexi or the whoop de whoop area there. Honestly, there's a part there where they were actually saying that uh, my the body roll on my vehicle kind of tilted to the left, which is kind of like what happened to Mike's Jeep there. But I, inside, I didn't even feel the uh, the body roll at all. Kind of just like a little bit, but it wasn't to the point where it felt like the whole shift was uh, going to one side. We're gonna continue on right now. We're on our way to Wells Lake now. The rest of the gang are gonna be um camping for tonight i am heading out so uh, i'm gonna be hitting up falcon hill after and also uh ifs ledge uh as well too as we're coming out of uh whipsaw here probably chill for a little bit but then i gotta gotta head out anyways see you guys there where do we want to camp i don't really see anybody can we go over towards the, the high or yeah because i i I usually camp over to the right right here. I want to go over to the high. No way. Caught one? Yep. Ha! Ah. Nice. <laughs> oh, nice. Is it a rainbow? I think it's a rainbow. It's got the red bow. There he is. He's a little one, this guy. The bull? The teddy? The little teddy? I'll put my pit bull. Oh, he gone. Nice. Bull trout. The first, first freaking. Uh, <laughs> didn't, he, there, didn't even take too long. I didn't think I was nearly gonna get out there. <laughs> that's crazy. Let's go again. There we go. <laughs> Would have been nice to actually stay for a night, but unfortunately, got some prior obligations for tomorrow. So I'm just heading out. Uh, the next obstacles are two that I remembered. One is Falcon Hill. And the other one is IFS Ledge, which is really close to each other. And after that, I'm gonna hit the FSR. And then this time, instead of last year, where we went right, 
towards Princeton. This time I'm gonna be going to the left, which is towards the Coquihalla, which is gonna save me some time. But anyways, time to go. All right, just got up this rotted out trail. About to hit up Falcon Hill here, um, right there. As you guys already know, it's been raining, so we'll see how slippery the rocks are. Uh, but yeah, come join me as we get up this hill. Let's go. got through it uh, I think we got one more obstacle there let's go check out underneath I don't see anything looks pretty good so bad line I was trying to climb on this side but just more onto passenger side on this side and I was able to get up uh, a little throttle and we were able to get up next one I believe is over there all right this seems pretty simple so idea here is just to drive all the way to driver we can probably even go to passenger it's not too bad uh but yeah let's go try it out got through that pretty nicely i'm gonna analyze whether or not i'm able to get up ifs ledge it is slick so we'll see but anyways let's go just got to ifs ledge okay cool let's go check it out all right that's the bypass it's a bit muddy so uh, that's the bypass right there. I can either go here, which is another bypass, just go through it, uh, but I have to flip the uh, mirrors, my side mirrors out. But yeah, IFS ledge. So uh, my idea is use my lockers, go as far to the left as possible, climb the rock, and up we go. Anyways, let's go. All right, so kind of messed up there for, at first. Uh, I actually didn't have my lockers on. Uh, got slippery right around here. Got up, had to back up a little bit. Got my tires more to driver, and then I was able to just climb and slide off and get a momentum going up that ledge right there. Anyways, we got up to IFS ledge. I'm good to go. All right, time to head home. Baby in the future. Uh, I'm by myself, so I don't feel like trying it out. <laughs> Anyways, I think this is where we were last um, after we got through all the obstacles. This is where we kind of stopped by uh, and it continues on over there. The rest of the trail here are just gonna be easy trails and then I get into the FSR. So. I'm just gonna move on to the next one, which is all my friends going through the same thing that I just went through. And yeah, let's go there right now. Passenger is just on a rock. What? It's just hung up on the side of a little rock there. Let's pop over.
Go, go, go. Anyways, that will do it for Whipsaw 2024. Hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, definitely coming back here again next year. Maybe the F-150. That doesn't have any lockers and maybe during a really nice day, I'll take the F-150 here. But yeah, that'll do it for this video. If you guys like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to the channel. Also hit that notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. Until next time guys, like always, stay awesome.